Comet Fan of Wheels, I'm here with another MCSG episode. Today we're on par 72. Today's a Saturday, uh, so how's everybody's weekend so far? Mine, to say the least, it's gonna be a busy weekend. Uh, unless I start getting productive, so yeah, we'll see what happens. Hopefully, I can get stuff done. Hopefully, after, after this recording, that guy is definitely hacking. He can, uh, he can screw off. Oh my god. Uh, I don't know where the hacker went, but whatever. That's none of my business. I don't care anymore. Um, anyway... I want to talk about collabs really quickly before I get into anything else in this video. Um, <clears throat> last episode, obviously, was a collab with Prez HD. Uh, if you've seen it, then thank you very much. If you haven't, then uh, I don't blame you. You know what? Y you're entitled to see whatever you want on my channel, and I don't really... Oh, God. Like, I'm gonna... Okay, okay. Are we good? Are we good? Yeah, I have a stone sword, so you don't really want to come near me. Uh, that was my phone going off, by the way. I don't know if you can necessarily hear that, but... Um, I want to go through my reasoning, just a rundown of my, uh, my collab reasoning and why I do it every once in a while, every here and there, why you'll be seeing a collab, and, um, yeah, why, why the, the reason for collabs, in my opinion. So, oh my god, is this the hacker team? Are you serious? Oh, alright, alright, yep, I think that, no, actually, it, it might not be, it might not be. They're, I think they're just boosting each other. Hopefully. And that's what I'm hoping for. Uh, if I can get far away enough, I'll eat this gapple and I'll be fine to, and ready to go, hopefully. Um, anyway, so collabs, in my opinion, or when, no, sorry, when I do collabs on my channel, uh, it's usually to introduce you guys to someone new, to somebody who I think you should meet, either because they're a cool person or because I, I know them well and I think they're very awesome and I think you guys um, should, get that, uh, should get to know them a little bit better. Um, yeah, that, that, that is my reasoning behind collabs. It's not to gain subscribers, it's not because I'm necessarily good at collabs, uh, although I do try my hardest, you know? Uh, if somebody asks me out of nowhere to do a collab, and, like, you know, they may be a cool person, I, I just never talk to them, but when a person asks me to, uh, to collab with them, and I've never talked to them before, I'm really iffy about it, because... Um, doing a collab just straight up without even talking to the person ever, like, vo um, voice to voice, like, it it's gonna be really awkward, and you guys know that to me there's nothing worse than an awkward collab, like, there's nothing worse than watching two people try to crack jokes at each other that are not necessarily that funny, and then it's just kinda awkward, you know, awkward collabs overall are, are something you wanna stay away from, it it's kinda cringy too, like, I don't really, I don't really enjoy them too much in my opinion, so... I try to stay away from them as much as possible uh, by doing collabs with people I actually know and just not people that I've never talked to before. And don't get me wrong, like, if I've never talked to you, it doesn't mean that I don't think you're cool. It just means that we've never talked. That That's it, basically. Um, so, yeah, that's the rundown of why every once in a while you'll be seeing collabs. But don't worry, uh, I know that most people like single-player um, commentaries, so... That'll be... Oh my god, that voice crack. <laughs> uh, that'll be mostly what you'll be seeing on my channel, so there's no need to worry about having too many collabs. Uh, you know, once again, like, I'm not the, the kind of person to do a lot of collabs. Like, I, I'm just not the kind of person that does very good collabs that are that enjoyable. At least I don't think, you know. You guys may think that collabs, that my collabs are enjoyable, and if you think that, then that's awesome. But if you don't, I don't blame you. So, anyway, on to the topic for this video. I'm getting, I'm getting all these kills really easily. What is this? But... I want to talk about jealousy on YouTube and how it affects your channel. Uh, jealousy. Oh, this is a weird-looking iron sword. I'm, I don't know if I like this. This is a weird style. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll test it out, I guess. Do I have a fishing rod? No, I do not. All right. But jealousy on YouTube usually comes from when uh, you see some. Well, obviously, when you see somebody who has done more accomplishments from you. But what I see on YouTube is that people are not necessarily jealous of of um how many subscribers or how many views people have, they're jealous of the way they got them. Uh, this is because YouTube in, in itself is a very weird kind of way to get popular. Um, to get known well on YouTube, there's not necessarily something you need to follow. Honestly, like, if, if you want to become a millionaire and, you know, have tons and tons of subscribers, there's not certain rules or certain guidelines you need to follow to get more popular. YouTube, you just do what you do, and sometimes it's kind of based off of luck, and this is just another, a whole other topic, you know, whether YouTube is luck or whether it's, uh, hard work. Um, 
but people sometimes think to themselves, oh my god, that guy puts no effort into their videos. Why do they even have that many subscribers? And I'm going to be honest, I used to be a really jealous person. I, I used to be really cocky. I used to overrate myself. I, I used to think my videos were so good. Now, I realize that's not the way to go. And that's not to, not, not the way to grow your channel. And um, being, but you're not going to accomplish anything by being jealous other than making yourself mad. So... Yeah, I mean, like, yeah, yeah. What, what was I going to say? Um, I'm sorry, I, I kind of got off topic there. Uh, YouTube it, in itself, there's no real reason, um, like, I don't know, let, let's say, like, there's so many channels out there, uh, there's countless, a countless amount of channels out there that get popular for no particular reason, or sometimes, sometimes they get part, or they get popular for being bad, and, you know, I'm not, I'm not calling out anyone here, but the Fedora Kid, if you guys know what I'm talking about, the Fedora video, the Fedora little kid who was like, oh my god, thank you so much for one like, that kid, like, blew up, I, I don't even know, he probably has like 100,000 subscribers by now, um, people get jealous of channels like this, and they're like, oh, why can't this happen to me? And you see, when, when you have an attitude like this, um, you're gonna start, you're gonna be able to notice it. You're gonna be able to notice how you're trying to be, uh, look like others, or how you're not really enjoying yourself in your videos. It's gonna make you a grumpy person, and overall, um, just lower your attitude standards. Nobody's really gonna, or maybe somebody, like, there's gonna be, there's obviously gonna be friends that are gonna talk to you, but, uh, when it comes to meeting new people, you're not gonna have as much fun. That's all I can tell you. So, in other words, um... Although sometimes jealousy may be kind of hard to avoid, um, you're gonna want to stay away from it as much as possible, and and keep your keep your thoughts to yourself. Never really say out loud, "Oh my God, how do you have this many subscribers?" It's just gonna make you a terrible person, and it's you're gonna you're gonna be able to notice it. Oh my God, are you serious? It's a death match. Am I really gonna have to lose another game? Are, are you serious? All right, I'm gonna try to get one kill. One kill. That's all I want. One kill? Can I get one kill? No, nope. no. Nope. But whatever. You know what? The commentary was enough for me. I am really sorry, guys. I feel so disappointed in not being able to win a game. But oh my goodness, it's kind of impossible with these deathmatch teamers. Um, but anyway, that's my thoughts on jealousy. You know, in terms of how to avoid it, I can't really give you much tips on that. All I'm gonna say is keep your thoughts to yourself and ignore it. Like, it's probably easier said than done, but that, that's really, I'm being 100% honest here. Ignore it. If somebody got popular and you don't find a good reason for them to be where they are at at that point, just ignore them. That's basically what you need to do. And you'll be ha you'll be a lot more happy, and most, li most likely than not, your channel will be a lot better in the future. All I'm saying is, uh, stay away from drugs, kids, and put hard work into your YouTube channel. I'm Fan of Wheels, and I'll see you guys next time.